Hello everyone, well, welcome to solve this math Olympiad algebra problem and here we have m plus n equals to 8 and m multiplied by n equals to 48 and here we solve this problem for the values of m and n. So here the very first thing we are going to do is here first we call this as equation number 1 and we call this as equation number 2. And now here uh, first we simplify equation number 1 and here we obtain equation number 3. So we write from 1 as uh, here we move this n to the right hand side and we have the equation number 3 is m equals to 8 minus n and we call this as equation number 3. So now we focus on equation number 2 and in equation number 2 we substitute this value of m in equation number 2. Uh, so that uh, we have uh, equation 2 implies that so this is equation 2 which is m times of n and uh, uh, we have the value of m is 8 minus n into n equals to 48 and after that here we need a little bit simplifications and now we multiply this n on both of these terms and we write it as 8 times of n minus n square equals to 48. And now in the next step uh, here we need uh, some uh, uh, simplification so that we uh, rearrange these all terms and we move these two terms to the right hand side. So uh, when we move this minus uh, n square to the right hand side uh, it will be written as n square it will becomes positive and this 8n becomes negative and we have minus 8n and this is plus 48 equals to 0. So now this equation will becomes in quadratic form so that here we use the quadratic formula in order to solve this quadratic equation. Uh, so first we write the uh, coefficients of this equation and its coefficients are a equals to 1 b equals to minus 8 and c equals to 48 and we know that about quadratic formula it is written as n equals to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times of ac divided by 2 times of a so this is the our quadratic formula and now we substitute the values of a b and c in this formula uh, so that this will becomes n equals to minus b and we have the value of b is minus 8 plus minus uh, square root of b square so our b is minus 8 square minus 4 times of a is 1 and c is 48 and this is divided by 2 times of a and our a is equals to 1. So after that uh, here we uh, need some simplification and we write this term as 8 plus minus we know that the square of minus 8 is equals to 64 minus so 48 times of uh, 4 equals to 192 square root and this is whole divided by 2 times of 1 uh, is equals to 2. So after this step uh, we have the value of n equals to 8 plus minus 64 minus 192 equals to minus 128 square root divided by 2. So here uh, we rewrite this equation as uh, because here inside the square root we have minus 128 we write this as 64 times of 2 square root and we eliminate the square root of minus 1 divided by 2. So uh, after that uh, here we need more simplification we have 8 plus minus we know that the square root of 64 is 8 into square root of 2 and we know that square root of minus 1 is iota divided by 2. So after that we have the value of n equals to 4 plus minus 4 times of square root of 2 into iota. So these are the two complex values of the given equation. So now we uh, use these values of n and we find the corresponding values of m from this equation number 3. 
so here we first copy down equation number three and we know that our equation number three is m equals to eight minus n and we have two values of n so we uh, write separate these two values and we have first value of n is 4 plus 4 into square root of 2 iota so this is the positive value and the second value of n is 4 minus 4 times of square root of 2 into iota so now we substitute these two values of n in this equation and we get the values of m so we have m equals to 8 minus n and the value of n is 4 plus 4 times of square root of 2 into iota so first we simplify this case and in this case we multiply this minus on both of these terms and we get 8 minus 4 minus 4 times of square root of 2 into iota and we have the value of m equals to 8 minus 4 becomes 4 minus 4 times of square root of 2 into iota so this is the value of m when we have the value of n is this one so here we find the first solution of the given equation is mn equals to we have the value of m is 4 minus 4 times of square root of 2 iota this is the value of m and the corresponding value of n is 4 plus 4 times of square root of 2 into iota so this is the our first complex root of the given equation so now we substitute this value of n in this equation and we have m equals to 8 minus n and the value of n in this case is 4 minus 4 times of square root of 2 into iota so now we multiply this minus sign on both of these terms and we have 8 minus 4 and plus 4 times of square root of 2 into iota and uh, here we have 8 minus 4 becomes plus 4 and plus 4 times of uh, square root of 2 into iota so this is the value of m and now uh, here we have the second solution of this question is we have the value of m corresponding to the value of n is so the second solution is m n equals to the value of m is 4 plus 4 times of square root of 2 iota and the value of n is 4 minus 4 times of square root of 2 into iota so this is the second solution of the given question and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos